Hi, I'm John Burt. I'm product manager for Teledyne LaCroix video products. So, um, what are these products around here? Uh, these are some of our HDMI uh, related test equipment. So this is the, the 980 advanced test platform. Uh, this device has uh, individual modules which enable everything from HDMI 1.4 all the way up to HDMI 2.1 testing. Uh, so we're a provider of uh, functional tests and compliance tests up to, through HDMI 2.1. And we help everybody from the, the chip manufacturers and designers all the way up to the TV, the set-top box, the Blu-ray player manufacturers. Uh, validate and test their devices for compliance. Nice. Can we turn it slightly a little bit? Uh, so it looks like it's a desktop computer or something and then uh, there's a bunch of boards and stuff, is that what it is? It is. Internally it's based on a computer type of architecture, yes. And we design custom modules to enable the uh, the video generator and the video analysis features. So your modules that are in there, uh, these, these, for example, uh, are there some kind of like video processing decoding code kind of things? They are. They're, they're custom uh, video generators and video analyzers. And so we have kind of a unique uh, uh, system in that we have to be able to capture the video at the bit level. So we capture the TMDS and the FRL clear down at the bit level. So we have low level protocol in addition to the video and the audio in our captures. What does it mean at the bit level? Uh, that means going down, it's a digital signal. The digital signals consist of individual bits, which are the ones and zeros that make up the digital signal. So if you get billions of those, you, you can have the, the entire, all the picture information and all the protocol information uh, that, that uh, consists of, of, of the video. And uh, uh, what are these machines around here? Uh, well, these two, the 280 is a pair. This is designed for uh, field installers and integrators. Uh, this helps the, the installers uh, test their devices as they're installing them, but importantly, it also helps them troubleshoot systems in the field. Everything from home theater to pro AV systems. So it's stuff to calibrate it or something? Uh, it can be used for calibration. So the 280G can be used with, uh, with CalMan, uh, calibration software to calibrate displays. But it's also used for troubleshooting. Say you have interconnection problems, maybe your picture is flashing or you have no sound. Uh, our devices can help troubleshoot those problems. So uh, I'm guessing this is a portable battery powered uh, unit. Uh, maybe it's ARM powered. I don't know. This could be an Intel powered. We work with all kinds of platforms on top of it. You, you do. Are you, are you working on Linux or? Uh, that's right. Well, this is uh, as the base of it is, is a Linux operating system on the 980. Uh, the lower end products are really not necessarily any operating system. It's just a custom uh, embedded uh, processor. Embedded system right here. Mm -hmm. And uh, how old is the company, Teledyne LaCroix? Well, Teledyne LaCroix is um, over 50 years old. Um, we've been making video products since uh, 1979. So it's always been about helping the industry make the products? That's always uh, helping, been the business? Helping industry uh, design, test, validate the products, uh, test the installations, uh, debug and troubleshoot, yes. So then if you are making an 8K TV right now in the industry, you buy one of those and then uh, you can just pick uh, 8K uh, on the, on the touchscreen? Absolutely. So these are what we call some playback files, which are one part of the 8K testing. So you can see the bottom next to last row, the 4320 formats. Yes. These are the 8K formats. And uh, yes, we can play these off to an FRL TV set. And, as soon as somebody has one in development that they can test. And uh, while the spec is being developed, your hardware is even more in demand because you uh, try to figure out what to do with the spec? Yeah, the spec is developed. Uh, the compliance test specification for how you test a product and how do you certify a product is currently in development. And uh, there are some products that are in development and we hope we'll see the products on the market soon. Things like TVs uh, specifically. What is this show? What does it illustrate? Is it part of the what you do, the, the testing? Yes, this is part of a, a, a tool we have that we call HDR Lab. And HDR Lab is a set of uh, test patterns and, and professionally graded HDR images that help you do things like analyze display performance and uh, possibly even analyze post-production processes.